Yo, what is good everybody? It's your boy Boone coming at you guys with a brand new video. Uh, I do have to start off this video just saying so much like thanks to all you guys that just showed so much love on my last video. Um, just the whole palace situation has been like so crazy. I have people still just blowing up my DMs, tagging me on palace posts saying like RIP Seattle Select, like bring back Boone and shit like that. So like shout out to all the supporters. You guys are the goats for real. Um, the amount of love you guys show me like it just blows me away 24-7 like for real. On God, I was talking about that shit to like so many of my friends about like just how crazy of a situation it was. Honestly, when I left that comment on the palace website I didn't really think too much of it like it surprised me they even responded and just like everything that's happened since is just crazy as hell to me so shout out to all of you guys um, but today we're not gonna be talking about palace unfortunately we're gonna be talking about some supreme action we're almost there folks we're so damn close the lookbook is dropping tomorrow so I'm just gonna go over the last remaining leaks we know before the lookbook officially drops tomorrow um, I know this is kind of like a funny video to make right like the day before we actually find out everything releasing however you know I just want to give you guys some entertainment Sunday. I know you all sitting at the cribbo, maybe on the Fortnite. Um, by the way, if you guys want to play some Fortnite, Seattle Select, come find me, Xbox. We out here getting dubs. I've been playing with a lot more followers recently, getting them some dubs, you know? So, uh, yeah, if you guys want to hit me up on the Fortnite, it's sh I also have to say, on Seattle Select, I am having my FTP sale this week. It's probably going to be on, like, Thursday or Friday. So, if you're into FTP, follow me on Seattle Select. The grails I have on deck are just stupid, bro. Like, I got only old FTP. Fuck you, me. We ain't doing that new shit you know how we come in 2018 only grails baby so that's gonna be an insane sale i got so much just dope stuff on the way honestly i'm so excited for the future i've just been feeling very motivated recently you guys have been showing the love like i've been saying so you know i really do feel it shout out to all of you guys y'all the goats let's just jump into the video though i'm gonna cut it with all the corniness um so yeah let's just talk about these leaks you guys there's some leaks that i don't even know if they're gonna be confirmed it'd be super awkward if i did talk about some stuff in this video that did not end up releasing tomorrow in the lookbook however drops by jay's confirmed a lot of this stuff so I do think it is true we're gonna start off with some accessory action um, the first piece I want to talk about is this little stepping stool ladder type thing uh, your boy doesn't even need this you already know I'm seven feet tall so like I don't even need this shit uh, I'm playing I am like six one though so I do not need this at all kind of a silly accessory in my opinion like it's one of those things that you cannot flex like a stepping stool like if you just own a stepping stool you're already taking an L I just realized I think I'm calling it a stool stepping ladder I should say I'm gonna see some hype beast pictures on Instagram on some stepping ladders like holding their head like this and I'm just gonna cringe so hard so uh, I'm not hyped on that accessory at all we also have this Mophie case dropping it's a whole new Mophie design um, they've usually been doing the little like separate Mophie battery packs this one will actually go on your phone um, my issue with this is that I know there's a lot of fake supreme phone cases they trigger the hell out of me when I see them in public especially girls I swear so many of you girls I see you with like the fake ass supreme stuff like come on what you doing any girls that are watching this video and own authentic supreme shit I'm sorry I didn't me to trigger you like that but I don't like this Mophie case too much just because it reminds me of all these boof ass supreme items I see everywhere and I don't know I just don't like the design I think your phone having fat ass supreme branding on it, it's kind of obnoxious um, I kind of felt the same way about like saying like the Ramoa suitcase it's just like unnecessary like I just think it's too loud you're just asking for too much attention to yourself next up we have the supreme scale um, this is one of the cooler accessories I've seen so far my issue with it is that the supreme branding so small like honestly what's the point of getting Getting this if it's just like a little baby little mini box logo if I'm gonna get a fucking scale that's supreme it better have some fat ass branding I know that's like the most contradictive thing to say because I just said the Mophie case is way too loud of branding but um, I think like a phone case like that's something you see a ton out in public and stuff like that and I think that's trying too hard whereas with like a scale that's just at your house and having a little scale with a tiny ass little box logo just it, I don't know it just seems irrelevant to me like it seems like pointless to even get however if it was a scale with this huge ass supreme letter on it I think it just make it more like memeish and just make it funnier and therefore make it more worth buying um, I don't know if that like opinion even makes sense but fuck it we're gonna keep going um, the last thing we have I am hyped on I'm not even gonna lie folks this shit lit as hell the supreme inflatable chair your boy needs this I might even have to be kicking it back being bull in that shit you know what I'm saying like um, my only issue with this one is that I do wish the supreme was on the backside not at the feet however I guess when you're chilling in it the ladies can see down by the feet region that it does say supreme on it um, your back would otherwise cover that up so that's a bonus so those are all the official accessory leaks we've gotten so far that drops by Jay's announced let me know if you guys have heard about anything else down in the comments those are the only things I've heard
heard about that have been confirmed. Like I said, I don't want to be giving you guys false information. But now that we're done with the accessories, I need to talk about these t-shirts. That's actually the reason I made this video um, because some of these leaks we have gotten about t-shirts are blowing me away. Um, if you guys saw my other leaks videos, I've talked about the leaks for the t-shirts and honestly, I was thinking the t-shirt graphics were looking disgusting. I only really like the anatomy one and even that one, like I don't know if I'd keep it for the personal. I do think it's a cool design. However, we've gotten two, actually I think like three new leaks um, that are blowing me away that I am stupid hyped on. So the first one that we're going to talk about has to be the Madonna tee. I know everyone's been going crazy about that. Um, if you guys didn't know, Madonna and Supreme are supposed to collab for this single t-shirt. I think it's going to be the only item in the collection. I think it is an official collab between Madonna and Supreme. I could be wrong though. This t-shirt reminds me a lot of the Shade t-shirt that we had a little bit ago. I pray to the heavens I am saying that right. I don't think there's ever been a video I've said this chick's name right. I don't listen to her music. I don't even know who the shoddy is, so I don't care about how to say her name. You guys care though so much that I'm just trying to care for you guys. So if I said it right, you have to obliterate the like button. Oh my God, bro, this video is so stupid. All right, but the Madonna t-shirt is looking dumb gas, bro. I'm into blonde chicks, so like you already know we cooking this one up. Probably not, you know, I suck at Cop and Supreme, but a homie can pray. I'm finna be busting nuts everywhere when I got this t-shirt on because Madonna used to be bad as hell. Let's not get it twisted. Shotta used to look bad as hell back in the day. I don't even care that Justin Timberlake and Alex Rodriguez have ran through it. I'd still smash, even if she's like 60, I'm playing. I actually wouldn't, that's disgusting. But um, I didn't listen to Madonna's music a ton back in the day or anything like that, um, but I love this picture of her. It reminds me a lot of Marilyn Monroe. The only thing I really like about Madonna is she looked like Marilyn Monroe, who I thought was bad as hell, so yeah. I'm definitely me buying this t-shirt and I think I'll probably keep it as well because I really, really like the graphic. I would guess this is going to drop week one. There's supposed to be 10 graphic t-shirts dropping week one, which is an insane amount. I think that's the most graphic t-shirts that have ever dropped in one week for Supreme ever. Week one drops are obviously always insane, but I'm a little rattled for this one, you guys. Like this is actually going to be like insane. This release is going to be gas. I cannot wait for the week one live cop. I'm going to make a little video on how to cop for week one with Supreme, giving you guys some tips. We do have some confirmed colorways for the t-shirts that we'll be releasing. We have a red, navy, black, white, olive, natural, bright blue, heather gray, and terracotta. I hope I'm saying that right, which is a very weird color. I had to look this one up, um, but these are some sick colorways. There's no yellow, there's no orange. So you already know I'm a little like a little salty. I'm not gonna front. Those are my two favorite colors, so I'm not sure how I feel about the colorways, but some of these weirder colors like the natural or the terracotta, I'm excited about. In my opinion of all the colorways, I think the terracotta is gonna be the best looking one on a lot of these t-shirts, um, but we have two other t-shirts to talk about in this video. So we have this one shirt. I think I think I saw it referred to as the melon shirt on drops by Jay and this is my favorite t-shirt I've seen so far I'd say um, I don't know why they're hiding this one actually I do know why they're hiding this one because it is too damn gas they certainly leaked some of the uglier shirts so far like what the hell is this stupid ass gangster squirrel doing um, but this melon t-shirt is looking super fire I need to see this full graphic because I'm hyped on this one um, I think this could be one of the hardest hitting t-shirts of the release alongside the Madonna tee and this other tee that just got like a hundred percent leaked um, it was partially leaked before. I don't even know what the name of it is. The shirt's designed by a homie named Weirdo Dave. He killed it on this shirt. Um, we have random edgy like um, sayings all over the shirt. We got the board fuck on it. So, you know, I have to cop. I love the edgy sayings from Supreme. I have no clue why. Probably because I'm a middle schooler at heart. I love this graphic though. I originally thought it was on the back of some shirt or something. Um, the first like little leak we got of it was only partially a picture of it. For whatever reason, I thought it'd be on the back of a shirt, but it is its own shirt. It's on the front of the shirt. I love Love this design. This is definitely going to be a Supreme shirt I need to keep. I don't even know why I like this shirt so much. I just kind of like all the random little like words and stuff on it. I really do like t-shirts that I feel like you have to look at a long time to fully like um, see everything on the shirt. I don't really like those just like quick little basic graphics. Shirts like this that are very detailed are certainly some of my favorites to cop. So I have to get this one. It would be so sick if they switched up some of the colors that go along with the words on the different colorways. I doubt Supreme actually does that. If they do though, shout out to you Supreme that would be so sick I really do hope you guys put the extra work into this shirt because it's one of my favorites that we've seen so far the final t-shirt I wanted to talk about was the bottle cap tee we've seen original leaks of this um, that just had like the Supreme bottle cap but we did not see the edgy saying that says piss off this way like under the actual logo again edgy saying alert your boy is hyped I might have to cop this one as well probably not for the personal because there's already enough edginess in this drop for me however I love the graphic I love like that little piss 
soft, turn sideways. Gives it that little supreme sauce of edginess, which is what I need. I'm actually becoming so hyped for this week one drop. I was already like super stoked about it, honestly, but seeing these new leaks and seeing some of these like full graphics has got me through the roof with excitement. You guys need to get ready with me for this week one drop. I might make some video on how to get your bread up before the drop. Um, let me know if you guys would like to see a video on that, but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Uh, it's been your boy Boone. Smash a like if you guys watched it all the way through. Once again, I have to say shout out to everyone that's just been showing love on my Instagram, um, on here on YouTube. Like you guys are the goats. You guys got me like in such a great mood. Um, honestly, I cannot thank you guys enough for the support always. I feel like I just haven't said that in a while, even though I said it at the beginning of the video. All right, it's time to cut this one off. Um, I'm getting obnoxious. <laughs> it's been your boy Boone. I'm out. Let's get ready for week one, boys. We got to cook it up. Let's get it. Fuck Palace. Deuces.